Body, we're down here at Kissimmee and we're talking lionfish. I just finished up a lionfish collecting and handling workshop here. We had about 20 people come out. Uh, I gave about a two hour presentation on lionfish ecology, biology, recent research, and then I talked about uh, safe and efficient collecting and handling techniques. Hey guys, uh, this year is our fourth annual lion tamer dive tournament. So what we're doing and what we've been doing over the last four years is trying to bring awareness uh, to the public and encourage divers and even snorkelers in the bay uh, to help us with this lionfish problem that we're having. So lionfish is a uh, invasive species that's not native to our area and they're eating a lot of the juvenile fish like snappers and groupers that we want to grow up to be big fish so we can enjoy later. So they have increased over the last four years. Our first year tournament we brought in nine lionfish. The second year it went over 140. And the third year, which was last year, we brought in over 450 lionfish for the tournament. So this year is probably going to be even greater. Hey, Alec Pierce here with the Florida Fish and Wildlife Conservation Commission. And we're here in Pensacola to celebrate the first annual Lionfish Removal and Awareness Day. And uh, we have events going on here in Pensacola. Obviously, you can look around. We've got a, a lot going on here. We've got Guy Harvey is here. We're going, we've got chefs doing some competitions. We also have people out in the water actually harvesting lionfish today. So this is a Pacific lionfish and it doesn't belong in our waters, but it has been introduced accidentally and over the past 20, 25 years, these, uh, these lionfish have populated the Atlantic and the Gulf. Here's a view of what our event looks like this year.